Hello, church. How are you doing today? I would like to start off by reading a passage to you from Titus 3, 1 and 2. It says, Remind the people to be subject to rulers and authorities, to be obedient, to be ready to do whatever is good, to slander no one, to be peaceable and considerate, and always to be gentle toward everyone. The Word of God. This is taken from the NIV. As we struggle through the COVID, these are the authorities that tell us whether or not we can come together inside. As you know, we have never stopped getting the word out to you, whether it be on the internet, on the courtyard, or here in church. We are happy to do that. Our staff is working so hard to deliver the message to you, and we will continue so. Moving on, I'd like to talk a little bit about the survey. We have compiled all of your surveys, whether they be online or in paper, and we have fallen a little short. We still need between 40 and 60 surveys. So some of you will be uh, being contacted and sent an email so you can do this survey online. Some of you that already have the paper ones and I have not turned them in, I, I beg you to please fill those out and send them, bring them into the church and drop them off. Mail them in. Whatever uh, you can do to get it here by the end of this week would be greatly appreciated. So we can get a broad spectrum of uh, the surveys and the uh, N NCS can do their job compiling that and getting us a report back. I want to speak of Thanksgiving, the holiday coming up. There is much for us to be thankful for. Even in this troubled time of COVID and a loss of pastors, we are still strong. We are still delivering the word to you. And as God plans out who will be our next lead pastor, well, we'll just have to wait and see. But I and the staff and the board are fervently praying for that pastor to step forward and for God to show us exactly who that pastor should be. So I want to again thank you for being devoted to this church and supporting it. And I want to wish you all a very, very happy Thanksgiving. And in the meantime, remember to wear your mask, social distance, and be kind to one another. Thank you.